Good morning ladies and gentlemen I am in one of the most unique places known as the experimental town for human unity unending education and creativity Welcome to Oroville So once you will come here you will find such hippie cloth shopping centers and cafes but Oroville is much more than that I know you guys are confused but first let me explain that what I mean when I say it is an experimental town So Oroville wants to remove human foundations like races titles position in fact they want to create equal opportunity for all the human beings be it a teacher carpenter painter which means everyone will be paid equally there will be no religion racism they believe in sustainable living and respecting nature more than anything else mostly support local go local you know live for humanity and like you know not harm the environment it's it's different it's completely different the lifestyle and whatever it is so this place was actually a vision of the mother mira alfasa and shri orobindo who wanted to create equal opportunities and such a place where all the nationalities can live together without any races without any differences So in 1968 at inauguration representatives from 124 countries and 23 Indian states came together which led to this place known as Oroval This is uh, the area to walk on jahan pe विजिटिंग पॉइंट की ओर जाते हैं माथी मंदिर की ओर सो इन और बेसिकली आपको सिर्फ इंडियंस देखने को नहीं मिलेंगे देर आर सम फिफ्टी नाइन नेशनैलिटीज ट्वेंटी सिक्स हंड्रेड एडल्ट सिक्स हंड्रेड एंड सेवेंटी टू चिल्ड्रेन एंड इट इज सच अ ब्यूटिफुल साइट टू सी दैट सो मेनी पीपल आर लिविंग टूगेदर स्टेइंग टूगेदर सेलिब्रेटिंग टूगेदर एंड वन ऑफ द थिंग्स दैट रियली इंस्पायर्ड मी वॉज द यूथ फेयर बिकॉज ओवर देयर देर वॉज दिस फेस्ट वेर एवरी वन केम टूगेदर वो सिंगिंग मेकिंग पिज्जा डांसिंग टूगेदर इट वॉज दिस अमेजिंग सो गाइज इट इज हार्ड टू इमेजिन की एक टाइम पे यहाँ पे कुछ भी नहीं था सिर्फ बैर एन लैंड था और अब इसी टाइम पे इतनी ज्यादा ग्रीनरी है सो पीपल जो अभी आपने ऑडियो सुनी है और अभी जो सुन रहे हो वो जे बी एल कमर्शियल बैटरी पावर्ड लेवेलियर माइक से है जो कम्पेटेबल है स्मार्टफोन टैबलेट मोस्ट डी एस एल आर कैमराज एंड मिक्सर एम्पलीफायर बिकॉज ऑफ इट्स थ्री पॉइंट फाइव एम एम टी आर आर एस जैक सो एज यू कैन सी दिस माइक इज ओमनी डिरेक्शनल मैं थ्री सिक्सटी डिग्री घुमा रही हूँ और ऑडियो क्वालिटी स्टिल द सेम है सो फॉर ओमनी डिरेक्शनल लेट्स टेस्ट वन मोर थिंग मैं अभी माइक यहाँ पे अटैच कर रही हूँ अपने डी एस एल आर कैमरा के सो दिस इज हाउ दी ऑडियो इज लाइक अगर मैं फ्रंट फेसिंग बात कर रही हूँ और अभी अगर मैं नाइन्टी डिग्रीज मूव करूंगी तो अभी भी ये माइक ऑडियो पिक कर पा रहे हैं बिकॉज ऑफ दिस ओमनी डिरेक्शनल फीचर एंड इट कम्स विद कैरी पाउ जिसमें आप अपना जे बी एल का माइक रख सकते हो दिस इज अवेलेबल एक्सक्लूसिवली ऑन जे बी एल कमर्शियल ब्रांड स्टोर ऑन एमेजॉन फॉर रुपीज नाइन नाइनटी नाइन सो जे बी एल कमर्शियल हैज हेल्प मी अ लॉट इन क्रिएटिंग ट्रेवल ब्लॉग्स सो यू गाइज स्टे ट्यून फॉर मोर जे बी एल प्रोडक्ट विच ऑफर लेजेंडरी एपिक जे बी एल साउंड अब मैं दोबारा जा रही हूँ और ओवल और मैं आपको दिखाती हूँ कि वहाँ के नजारे कैसे हैं we are in a very very secluded area in oroville and the roads have suddenly become super narrow and super bad and there is just sand and it's scary to ride because you can slip any time but we are going to a very interesting place let's see how it is like i'll reach there and i'll let you know about it my name is chitra i am from kotakare okay and you have been working here for how long 15 years working here here all of us making share recycling work zero waste policy so this is what paper the newspaper this is hindu newspaper here 20 ladies here working now is here corona time is here order is here less that's why it's a rotation is here five ladies six ladies working every day so you see this ear rings yeah. actually this is made out of uh, the bottleneck is a pet bottle oh wow that has become this uh dvd oh, wow we are recycling that uh, those dvds are you an orvilian yes i'm an orvilian so um, yeah. since how long have you been here i've came in 1997 so i've been 24 years here oh wow yeah. 
And you're from where? Basically? From Australia. Australia. Mm -hmm. I was really inspired by the dream of Oroville okay. and um, I felt very at home here when I first visited and it just was everything I'd, I'd been kind of dreaming about. Okay. Um, I felt it was a really beautiful place with an incredible vision of human unity and sustainability and really trying to create a new way of living. Regarding sustainability as well, can you explain yeah. how this started and what you're doing here exactly? Sure. So we do um, cloth pads, cloth washable menstrual pads increase the efforts towards creating a social enterprise which would build reach for the products so not just for Oroville but to see if we could create income generating opportunities for rural women and offer India an option of a um, sustainable non-polluting menstrual product. Five, six cloth pads would probably be good for a cycle. They last about 75 washes, which means pretty much up to four or five years if you look after them. And a full cycle kit which has seven pads is about 1500 rupees. Oh, so, nice. yeah. These two stories inspired me so much because they are ladies, lady entrepreneur, and they are moving their life in such a beautiful way, protecting the environment and doing it in a sustainable way, which was amazing. I was very, very inspired. With more than 3,500 people staying there, you will get a lot of people to see a but no one owns the property. It is owned by the community. No one actually owns that land. So this is your creativity. You have built this. Yes, this was made by my husband, I think in 1990 or so. The best part is this actually, the, the hatch door. Yeah, yeah, it's it's down. It's true. Yeah. <laughs> that is very creative. Yes. Then you can do your yoga meditation here. It's lovely. We could see the Bay of Bengal. What? Yeah, we could a long time ago, but then with all the trees, we cannot see it anymore. You know that Oroville runs on a cashless economy system. So, uh, for the most part, what we get is a form of maintenance, which is basically fulfilling all our basic needs. Uh, and that is groceries and, uh, you know, if we want to contribute, for example, for a yoga class. All of that is free for our civilians. We have a lot of benefits. Education is free for the most part. You are given an account and uh, it's a virtual thing because you never really uh, transact the way you would in a normal bank mm -hmm. and uh, so with this account uh, your maintenance is deposited there every month you can go to Portus, you can go to Tanto, you can go to visitor center uh, get whatever you need and it is debited from that account but Oroville also has a gro grocery system where it is uh, you don't even need to uh, spend out of your account for every shopping trip. You give a minimum contribution every month and then you take what you need. In my view, human unity is exactly this, that people from different cultures and races are coming together here and we are able to live together. I think that's beautiful. So my husband is French, I'm from North India and we have two lovely boys. So in our family we have English, French, Hindi and Tamil. So now we have a youth center. Here in this youth center, there are very creative houses built by wood and trees. Se. So over here, people come and practice art. Uh, they want to grow vocationally and they let their creativity flow in free form. So here, whatever they are thinking, they draw, they paint, they build creative houses and it is, it is like a world in another world. <laughs> you are good too. The biggest seesaw ever. So Oroville just start over there, so many different nationalities. Say, buses me bed ke log aaye the. One of the bus ye hai. Ab of course art ban chuka hai, creative stuff ban chuka hai. But aisi buses me log aaye the. This is such a colorful one. We are uh, in Tantos Beach. This is a lot of Oroville. And behind the beach is clean up. And uh, 
सनसेट बहुत सुंदर हो रहा है बट मुझे खुशी नहीं हो रही सनसेट को देखते हुए क्योंकि इतना ज़्यादा प्लास्टिक है ये लोग चार बजे से लगे हुए हैं और अभी टाइम हो रहा है साढ़े पाँच डेढ़ घंटा हो चुका है और अभी तक प्लास्टिक उठा रहे हैं एंड आई थिंक दीज गाइज विल लेट यू नो बेटर द इम्पैक्ट इट हैज़ ऑन द मरीन लाइफ सो आई जस्ट लर्न दैट थर्मोकॉल वन इट गेट्स वेर इट बिकम्स इन द स्मॉलर पार्टिकल्स एंड मरीन लाइफ टेन टू थिंक इट्स फिश एग्स सो दे एंड अप ईटिंग इट एंड इंस्टेंटली डाई See this plastic over here? Yeah. It's so thin. It's so thin. It might break into millions and millions of micro pieces. We call it microplastic, which are less than five mm in length. It ends up in the ocean again, ingested by the fishes, and then it comes to humans. It's a cycle. So recently there was a study where we found microplastic even in the placenta of a mother's womb. If that doesn't scare you. I don't know what would. So real Oroville can only be explored with a local. और जब आप अंदर जाते हो main streets में which you can only go with the help of a local, आपको बहुत कुछ देखने को मिलेगा कि people are doing so much. Some are doing organic farming, some are researching about cashless economy. Some people are in village development. They believe in handicraft and small scale industries, healthcare education. We took part in music therapy. There was also a potter's market where everyone was showing their art and talent. and then we also have like other extra curricular subjects like atb it's not really a subject but like you learn about your body like how it works you have to like meditate and then like feel your body like your senses after school everybody should go to like a extra curricular sports activity we don't have exams we have like tests to like uh, see if you can pass to the next grade or not it's just to see what you have what, like what are you good in and what you're not so great in so if you are not so great in one particular subject let's say maybe science mm. then what happens do you go to the next class next level or no you still go to the next class is just that the teacher helps you more in that subject isn't oroville awesome all i want to say is don't come to oroville just thinking it's some tourism hub but try to understand how these people are living so differently in such a unique way for me being in oroville is is more than just a lifestyle i mean it's it's a place that i feel deeply at home and has a meaning around you know really creating an experiment for a whole different way of living and i think it's a really important experiment um very much needed in our global situation right now try to impart all of this into your life unending education and constant progress creativity from anywhere from any part of the world until then i'll see you guys in the next video hope you liked it baki like share comment subscribe for the algorithm bye bye take care